this is this our, this is our third recording session October 16th Wednesday 1957 in room 364 this is our next recording session so we will proceed with the happening This is the day that the first rocket ship will take off for the moon. We have microphones and men stationed all over New York. We now switch you down, down to Times Square. Take it away, Walter Cronkhead. This is Walter Cronkhead downtown. I will try to get as many opinions of this great event as I can. Excuse me, sir. What do you think of this trip to the moon? I'm all shook up. Thank you, idiot. Hey, what's going on here? Well, sir, we're conducting an interview. What will you be doing when the rocket takes off? Just walking in the rain. Thank you, sir. Now, sir, what do you think of the rocket? And you, sir, do you think that many people will be scared when the rocket leaves? Now don't you worry your pretty little head. Now we switch you to the Dover Air Force Base, where they're preparing for the takeoff. This is Sam Scooby. You remember me. I goose Pocahontas. I have arranged an interview with the crew. First, we'll hear from the pilot and captain. Sir, what is your name? Another question, sir. When do you expect to leave? Well, that'll be the day when you... Sir, where do you think your rocket will land? In the middle of an What will be your main dress of uniform when you arrive? Wait, ladies and gentlemen, there is a crowd by the ship. Well, what do you know? A drunk. Sir, what have you got to say about this whole mess? Mucky rocky, lucky ducky, mucky rocky, riddly roo. Now back downtown. Take it away, Walter Cronkhead. Hi, we're back again. We only have a time for a few few more interviews before the actual takeoff. Wait, there goes Marilyn Monroe. Girl, I'm gonna get to you lie. I'm gonna get to you lie. We interrupt this program to bring you a commercial. Winston tastes good. Ask Sarah. This is WJC, Dover, Delaware. Now back to our original program. How about you, sir? What are your friends doing tonight? <laughs> All my friends are popping the blues, it must be going round. Well, that's it from here. Back to the Dover Air Force Base. Take it away, Sam Scrooby. This is Sam Scrooby back at the Dover Air Force Base. Captain, when will the ship take off? <laughs> Captain, what does the crew usually say about you behind your back? You ain't nothing but a hand <laughs> Captain, before you leave, may I have another word with you? The captain is standing in the door of the rocket ship now. He's saying goodbye to his wife. Everything is quiet, and the thousands of people here are staring into the darkness and yelling. The captain's stars, darling, they're shining very bright. Everything is set and the rocket is ready for blast off. 10, 9, 8, 7, 5, 4, 3, 6, 1, 2. gentlemen that's about it for tonight we now take it back to wesley junior college in room 364 the old main where the three geniuses mike callum bruce boldison and bob black have just recorded their third and final recording of this week we we'll hope to have a nice time listening to these records and be good take it away brett chrysler <laughs> Go, Red, go! Go, Red, go! 